This edition of Mac Voices is brought to you by Take Control Books, the answers you need now from leading experts. Learn more and download yours at TakeControlBooks.com. Hi, I'm Chuck Joyner. This is Mac Voices at WWDC and the Alt Conference in San Francisco. We're at Alt Labs in Jillian's talking to Phil about the NS Conference, NS North Conference, excuse me, uh, a design and developer conference in Ottawa? In Ottawa, Canada, yes. Great. Yes. So design and developer, that's... Does that mean it's all tech, or do you uh, spill into other areas? That's right. There's a lot of tech conferences, and we know we need tech, WWDC being the prime example, and sure. there are other conferences that do very technical things. We decided to differentiate ourselves a little bit by being a bit more um, higher level, if you wish, like taking a step back of uh, either it's how to run a business, like if you're a developer, you may not know how to run a business, or you may have difficulties with it, or uh, how to interact with a lot of other things, like you're a developer, you're indie, you want to find out how to really get to know a contract designer, so uh, or um, uh, you, even your accountant or something like that. So there's the, these kinds of levels of talks, and then there's levels that are even higher, like uh, uh, women in the community and um, uh, App Camp for Girls or uh, the equivalent that we have in Canada that's called Ladies Learning Code. So we had uh, Nicole from Ladies Learning Code come and talk about us to the, for the efforts that they've done in Canada to build these different chapters across the country and they're branching out and they have girls learning code. So it's very synergistic with uh, App Camp for Girls. Yeah. Exactly. That's yeah. great. That's great. Yeah, we think so. So the the, we, the conference has happened twice already. So uh, in 2013 and 14, and in uh, 14 we decided to give it a theme, and it was uh, it was about community and family. So uh, we held it even at the Museum of Nature in Ottawa, which is very family oriented, as you would imagine a Museum of Nature would be. Yeah. So it's pretty awesome to be able to have a. A, a conference and then you walk out and you're in the fossil gallery and you have cocktails and food and stuff and you can just mingle. So it's really about bringing people together and having awesome speakers that glue everything together but ultimately you're in a room with a thousand or uh, sorry a hundred or so um, smart people uh, and then me and uh, <laughs> and then you get to mingle yeah. and you get to talk about them and you bounce ideas off and it's pretty awesome. I think it's uh, it's everybody has come up to me and hope they're not just you know blowing smoke, but it seems like it's been pretty good, yeah. It, it's, it sounds, I mean, it's really interesting. The the attitude that is over at WWDC, the attitude that is at AltConf, and the overlap between the two, but there's there's definitely a distinct difference. Yes, very much so. Over here at, at all conference, there's, there's some of the higher level things. There's some of the more, for a better word, practical things yes. that are being discussed. Yes. Um, over there, it's pretty much strictly about the code. Yes. And that's fine. That's, as it should be, actually. Absolutely. It's absolutely. a developer conference. But as developers get together, it seems like they're taking a broader view of things. And I love the fact that you're including it and in, in looking at it as a family event. So it's not just a bunch of geeky guys yeah. and even geeky girls, you know, but bring everybody in and, you know, well, introduce them to the, to the if, community. If people are interested, we do have the website uh, that's still up. It's uh, nsnorth.ca. Okay. So uh, it's really nice to have a short domain. Those are rare these days. Yeah, yeah really. <laughs> exactly. But nsnorth.ca, and you can take a look at our, um, our our speaker lineup from this year and last year, and you can take a look. These are some pretty awesome people that I'd like to hear about. And the one thing that I did that, uh, well, that we did, because it's with my partner, Dan Byers, and I, we the two of us built this little conference. Uh, one cool thing that we did that we hope other conferences would pick up on is um, we do podcasts with the speakers. Like prior to, in the, the time in between that you've announced your conference and the conference actually happens, we take 15, 20 minutes with each speaker um, and they're from all over the place. And we, we talk about them, not about what they're gonna talk, but about them. Right. So that when you get to the conference, you, you hear, I, Wait, I've heard the podcast. I, I know about your 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 origin story, right? And I don't. You don't need to spend ten minutes of your talk talking about it. The other cool thing about NS North is that uh, by design, we have half the speakers you've probably heard of, like you you know Matt Thompson, Don Melton, <clears throat> Jesse Char, awesome people. Yeah. And then there's uh, the other half that you may not have heard of, uh, Nicole Belanger, for instance, or. Um, well, Charles, you probably have heard of, but um, uh, <clears throat> uh, lots of other speakers. The other half, uh, Caroline Sauvé last year. You, uh, you, you may not have heard of, but then you realize, hey, these people have something to say. It's really interesting, and it's bringing you 
new blood to the circuit, if you wish, and introducing you to new people. So, given that, between that and the podcast, which you can still, if you go to their website, you can get the podcast from right. all the speakers, and you want to know more about some of these speakers, you can already do that. The, the, the most downloaded feed on my site is by far is podcast.xml, right? Because all the clients, they pound that file, they download it all the time. Well, and that's why I'm doing these interviews here. Exactly. It's, it's, it's fun to, to suddenly realize that these developers are people. Yes. You know, and yes. They, they are very passionate about what they yes. do. In a lot of cases, they're very single minded about what they do. But it's still, they, they produce some amazing apps, and, and they're the things that the rest of us use yes. every day. So I, I think it's fantastic that, you know, you. That's a great way to introduce people to the speakers at your conference yeah. because you're right. They they learn in the origin story. They find out, you know, yeah. maybe the guy has a dog. You know, I, I don't know. Yeah. Well, but, well you know. actually, Don Melton has a dog, and we went into yeah. 15 minutes of how his dog was hurt, and then he we mended it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so th these are real people, and exactly. You know, it, it, I think that just makes it all a lot more appealing and a lot exactly. more approachable. Yes. So. And then you realize that what their passions are. Parisa, at the conference, uh, her passion is travel. She went to St. Petersburg to. You know, it's mm -hmm. the, you learn all about those things, and yeah. those are things that you might learn in a one-on-one -on -one conversation. Are just, but it's kind of nice to know them beforehand, so that you can find if you have common interests and things like yeah. that. So, and given that it's a small conference, people are approachable, right. right? So you want to be able to to talk to them, and once they come off the stage, they're not, they're not just these these uh, people that. I don't know, you, you, you've heard them, you're starstruck or something, or you're too shy to talk to them. No, you already have a rapport with them, and it's small and intimate, and that's really, it's all the goals, you know, yeah. building community. So, has 2014 has already happened? Yes, it was in May. It was in May. Okay, yes. so what, what do we have for 2015? Oh, much like the fruit company, we don't pre-announce products. <laughs> <laughs> I did drop okay. some hints about, uh, because we have, uh, in Ottawa, we have the Parliament Tower, which is a peace tower, mm -hmm. and the museum, when they rebuilt the front, they put a nice glass tower, like an Apple store, but like three stories tall. So I made some hints about the two towers. So, and of course, we were in a, in a, a colonial Victorian museum, so I, uh, I said, you know, it's like, like, it's like the empire and stuff like that. So, you know, I thought it was being uh, as subtle as a two by four, but yeah. apparently uh, some people didn't get the hint. So, yeah, we dropped some hints. All right. Well, so, so we get hints, but. Um there's definitely will be a 2015. I can't say if there's going to be definitely. There's so many things in the air, but uh, we'd be silly not to think about it. Okay. Given the response we've had and uh, people that said, "Oh, I so wanted to come," and and uh, couldn't because honestly, this year it was even Mother's Day weekend. Wow. So we actually moved it by one day instead of doing Friday, Saturday, Sunday, which we normally do. We did uh, Thursday. Friday, Saturday, so that Mother's Day would be free because pretty much everybody we asked, um, their husbands, their wives, their moms, would say, no, you, <laughs> you have to be around for Mother's Day. You're not getting that many air miles out of me. <laughs> so, <laughs> and, and it worked out beautifully. We had, we had um, full attendance and uh, everybody was delighted and it, it just worked out really well. That's great. The website, one more time, where people can go to see what was going on. And by the way, folks, to put some pressure on him to make next year's conference happen. <laughs> I think that's only fair if you're that, not going to announce. That is so. absolutely only fair. <laughs> I, uh, we can take that. Yes. Uh, the website? The website is nsnorth.ca. And uh, you can follow us on Twitter at, uh, at nsnorth. And I'm Phil, Phil at nsnorth.ca. And again, my partner, Dan, is also Dan at nsnorth.ca. So thank you so much for the time. It's great to talk thank to you. Thank you so much, Chuck. Folks, we'll have more from WWDC and the Alt Conference in San Francisco. I'm Chuck Joyner. Thanks for watching. Visit macvoices.com for links, show notes, to subscribe, to connect with Chuck on Twitter, app.net, Google+, Facebook, and LinkedIn. Subscribe to our weekly newsletter, the Mac Voices Dispatch, to stay up to date with all the latest Mac Voices news from our front page or at macvoices.com slash newsletter. Advertising and sponsorships handled by Backbeat Media at backbeatmedia.com.